What is going on, ladies and gents? So, do you guys have a person or persons, several individuals that keep just watching all of your stories, right? They watch literally 90% of your stories, right? They literally watch nine out of 10, if not all of your stories. Yes, if not all of them. But you notice they don't never like your shit. They don't never comment. Hell, you might even DM them and they're probably just going to not answer you back. You feel what I'm saying? If you even do that, right? But they don't comment. They don't like. They don't. I mean, besides them creeping and being weird and looking at all your stories, right? You don't even pretty much know that they exist because they don't interact with you. All right. And there's a reason for this. And I, first of all, I know what somebody is thinking. It's just social media, dude. Don't take it uh, too serious. Social media is as much of our life now, right? Maybe that would have applied when social media was just coming out, that whole it's just social media thing. But social media is so much a part of our lives that it damn near is our lives, okay? So until some kind of great societal reset, like uh, the ancient Egyptians or the ancient Greeks, Greeks and all that, until that happens, yeah, social media is here and, and full effect, all right? So anyway, I'm gonna get into why this is happening. First of all, this is Terry Talks. You guys could have been anywhere in the world, but you are here with me and I humbly appreciate it. All right, so, and first of all, I'm not talking to my fellas or my ladies that added me off of my videos, right? Because y'all don't really know me like that. You know what I'm talking about? So I don't, I'm not talking to y'all. I'm talking about folks that you actually knew and that you might have semi fell out with or you just kind of lost contact for whatever reasons and you're not on bad terms but you're not quite on the best of terms either. Like something happened, okay? But you see, you they are constantly looking at all your stories, right? Now, granted, no one is forcing you to post stories, okay? Let me just get that out the way. But you can you can do it if you want to, right? And what like I said, these folk will look at all of your stories, right? All literally every single one of them. Okay, literally every single one of them, and they'll be creeping on your shit. But you might have done posted, I'm talking about actual posts, not stories. You done posted like 40 posts. They didn't like, comment on now one. They didn't like or comment on now one of your shits, but they watch every single story religiously. They might damn near be the first person to watch the stories. You asking yourself, why is this, right? What is the psychology behind it? Because people, look, this is, a, this is the type of weirdness that social media done sparked up, right? Because me personally, bro, I, I'm just gonna go ahead and, and say this, no offense. I barely look at anybody's stories for the simple fact of, drum roll please, brrr, I don't give a fuck, right? I really don't care and, and you know about anyone, what their life is doing and everyone has a special life and they're blessed right? Thank God, thank Allah, thank Jehovah, whatever, whoever your savior is. Thank them for blessing you with life, right? But I personally don't care what mofos is eating. I personally don't care what mofos is listening to or what they are doing on a day-to-day -day or what they're, you know what I'm saying, what they're eating or drinking or smoking. I don't care. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm not trying to be harsh. I just don't have time. But you get these folk that watch all of your stuff. And the reason is... The reason why they do this, why they watch all of your stuff, but don't ever DM you or like your shit or comment or nothing is because they're envious. Yes, they don't like you. And I know what you're thinking. Well, why would they watch my stuff if they don't like me and they're envious to keep tabs? I don't know what it is. I wish I could ask some kind of psychologist, right? I wish I could ask some kind of psychologist what is going on in these folk head. They are keeping tabs on you. They're watching your moves. Yes, this is creep vibes. This is why recently, and this is what inspired this video. There's been a couple of people, right? A couple of them that watch every single one of my stories. And these mofos, they would rather die first before liking or anything or commenting or any, they would rather die before they do that, right? They're doing this on purpose. 
Okay, you guys need to, you know, a, a lot of people, it's just social media. You ha, you like, you got to think deeper because like I said, social media is as much a part of our lives as real life. Okay, so you need to be cautious. These people are monitoring you because they're looking at your real life. Okay, they're looking at your real life. Okay, so you need to, first of all, you need to delete these people ASAP. You need to delete them ASAP because first of all, they're just looking at your life. You might not even look at none of their shit. And these folk that I'm talking about, I don't look at, I promise to God, I, I, be, I be even forgetting they, they exist. And I knew these people in real life, right? I be forgetting they exist until they look at every single one of my stories, right? I don't even know they exist. Like that's how less, that that's how much they, uh, care about me. You feel me? They don't even, they, and a lot of times it's weird. They don't post anything either, right? It's weird because they themselves don't post anything. Not all the time, not all the time, but a lot of times, a lot of times they don't even. So it's like, why are they even looking at your shit? Yes, because they're, I'm sorry, bro. Like some people might say I'm, I'm overreaching, but it could be not all the time, not not every single time, but a large majority dog. When they're looking at when they're looking at um your your stories, look, I'm gonna pretend like this 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 their phone, and they're looking at it. I'm gonna pretend. Let's pretend this uh, little backlight remote is the phone. They're looking at at your stories just like this. Hey, fuck you. You ain't all that. I could lift more than that. That's how they, bro. I'm telling. This is how they're looking at your stories. They're envious. They're rolling their eyes and saying "f you" and "you're not all that." I'm telling, bro. This is this is what they're doing in behind the screen, bro. And these folk that be watching a lot of my stuff, all my stories, I know them. Like I told you, I know them in real life, bro. When I see them in person, they have the most off energy. Like the energy that they have, and this is a this is another reason why I'm making this video. Is because I'm just noticed. I'll be noticing this, and it's kind of weird. Like I said, this whole social media age them bred a group of weirdos. I don't know what it is. When they see me in a re at least the people that I'm talking about, when they see me in real life, they got this real like shaky and like this whole huh, hey, you know when you get a vibe from someone that they don't really want to talk to you, but you you made eye contact already and they got to put on this fake smile like, hey, how are you doing, Terry? Hmm. Hey, how are how are the wife and kids? You That's the type of vibe I get. But in the same essence, why the hell do they watch all of the stories, right? This is why, ladies and gentlemen, because they're keeping tabs on you. You feel me? All these friends in the past or broads that, you know, try to string you along and play this little texting game without meeting up. They're going to keep looking at your shit, right? They're going to keep looking at you because they're keeping tabs. You feel what I'm saying? So that's why you need to you need to delete it. OK, because people. Hey, look, man, uh, we don't we don't know people's intentions nowadays. People nowadays are. For, this is why I'm telling you guys this. It's not just something I'm just pulling out, pulling out of my my behind. People be having intentions. You dig what I'm saying? They have all they be having malicious motives. And for them to just keep watching your videos, you know, for them to just keep watching your videos that for whatever reason, bro, they might be, they might not like you for whatever reason. They might not like you cuz cuz in their heart, they feel like 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 you know what I'm saying? Like you are they're envious of you. They feel threatened by you, which which they shouldn't. You feel me? Which they shouldn't. Especially me. I'm a bro. If you know me in real life, I'm harmless. You feel me? I'm I am harmless in real life. But they be th feeling threatened by you, whether it's because you do something better than them, or you have something that they have, or maybe they look at your social media and be envious, like, oh, look, he's going out and, and I can't, and you know, I got an old lady that's, that's making me miserable. So I can't leave my crib and, and shit, something, whatever the, the, whatever the case is, they're looking at it and they don't, they don't like it. Okay. But the weird thing is, like I said, when they see you in public, they're going to give you weird vibes. You're going to feel the same type of vibe. Press one, look, type one in the comments if you know exactly what I'm talking about. Cause I'm trying to explain to the best of my ability. It's the vibe where, okay, 
let's say the guy that, that, that keep looking at all your videos or female, whatever, keep looking at all your videos. Let's say their name is Billy, right? Or stories that look at all your stories, but don't never interact with you. Don't never do nothing else besides look at your stories. Let's say their name is Billy, right? You see Billy in person. When you go up to Billy, right? Because you done already made awkward eye contact. Okay, you done already made awkward eye contact. You go up to Billy and they start smiling at you. But this smile feels forced. And you get a vibe from them that they're like, damn, I don't, I, I didn't even want to see this guy, right? I didn't even want to see him. Why is he even here? Like you get that type of vibe, like, damn, why is he here? Right? I don't, I don't want to talk to you, but they want to watch all your videos. Like I said, I'm going to just leave it at this. Just delete them people because honestly on some real shit, like I'm not even trying to be like over dramatic with it, but that's halfway stalkerish vibes, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's halfway stalkerish vibes. If someone don't even like you, if someone don't even, if someone barely says hi to you in public when they see you or watch all of your shit, I don't care what nobody says. That's that's borderline. Oh, maybe they're just bored looking at. Nah, there's there's definitely another. Look, if like I said, if I don't care about somebody, bro, I'm not finna watch their shit because I don't care about them. So obviously it's some it's something going on. Anyway, that being said, hope y'all like the video. Peace.